All right, Scuba Duba. Tell you what happened. I left this at my sister's house, hoping you know if the power went out, they'd have a generator. Well, my sister being such a fucking idiot, she didn't maintain anything around the house, and this thing got oxidized really bad inside this petcock, right around his elbow. I couldn't stick a wire in. I couldn't get nothing. There's some kind of weird fucking machine part, and that's pressed in a little elbow. I'm replacing the fuel line because it's all fucking hard. I could probably shatter that thing. And uh, the tank, of course, was fucking full of rust. You can see inside this fucker. No rust, just pits. You like that? All the rust is there and in the fucking woods. Well, anywho, to be continued, if my sister brought this to fucking Gano's, that big guy at the fucking counter, Steve, whatever his fucking name is, he would charge like 500 fucking dollars to do what I'm doing right now, taking about 15 minutes. I did soak it. I, I had, didn't have cut chem tool. I used goof off. I just put it in that hole and then I fucking spray it out with a compressor. It went pop and come right out. So any fucking who, um, I did have to take that to the house to air it up and bring it over here. But this is going to stop that. I can air up anything anywhere. And I won't have to plug it in anymore. So thank you, Scoop Steve. Scoop Steve has come to save the day. One more video of it running. I'm out.